Hi, I'm Peter Gisaitis, and I'm here with freshman standout Nick Olson. So, first of all, Nick, there's been a lot of talk. You gotta settle the debate once and for all. I've been telling people you're seven feet. How tall are you? Uh, I'm actually r right between six nine and six ten. So, uh, actually, I, I tell people I'm six ten, just because it, it sounds better. And I don't know. So it is. Okay. What about with shoes on? Do we get up to that seven foot range? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe if I'm wearing some nice, like, couple inch. Uh, platform shoes or maybe something like that. So you've been uh, with the team for a couple months now. What do you think? What are your first impressions? Oh, it's great. Like every practice is just what I expected. It's competitive but fun, and it's just it's really exciting. So every day, looking forward to practice. I can really hear the energy in your voice when you talk about yeah. it. It's good. What about uh, you individually? How do you think you're doing in terms of volleyball? Um, it was it was definitely a little little tough adjusting, just because I the you know, new setters new new environment, but I've definitely felt like I've uh, come into a, you know, a groove right now, starting to click with everyone. Yeah, what specifically have you been working on? Um, really right now I've been just working with my offensive timing and just working with the setters and seeing if it can, we can get on the same page with a lot of stuff, um, as well as my blocking and just reading, this, reading the, uh, the opposing setter and making strong moves. Okay. Talk about uh, the coaches while you've been working on these things. Give me a little bit about each coach. Um, well, definitely uh, Mark Hulse has been just really helping me with my blocking and offensive timing and stuff, and it's really been helping me get um, stronger as a player, especially with the other setters and the other players. Okay. Um, then uh, Chris Berzins has been helping me a lot with my serve, like my float serve, and uh, Shane obviously just helps everything, just little things here and there, kind of like John Wooden, doesn't really say a lot of things, but he'll say the right thing real quick. <laughs> You know exactly what he's, he wants you to do. That's good. I'm sure Shane would take that as a compliment. So other than your height, what is your most unique skill that you bring to the table? Um, I think it's more my, uh, just my experience that you know, I've been in a lot of pressure situations. I, if you give the ball to me, I know for sure I will I'll make the right play. That's some confidence. Yeah. So yeah. now, volleyball aside, tell us a little bit about your experience so far at Loyola with students and in the city. Well, it's great. Like the one thing you really notice that everyone here is really happy all the time. You always see smiling faces, and that's just awesome. Especially when you're having kind of a bad day. You look around, everyone's real happy. Kind of boosts your mood. Um, and just Chicago is awesome. Just a great city. A lot of things to do. Just a wonderful place. You had any experiences in the city yet? Any memorable uh, ones? Uh, not much. I actually I don't have any classes downtown, so I don't actually travel mm -hmm. down there much. Um, I really I want to at some point, but maybe that'll happen sooner or later. Yeah, well, get it in before the winter hits. Um, sure. What challenges have you faced dealing with Loyola, not volleyball, but either academics or where you live or dorm life? Or um, definitely just trying to like just stay on top of my studies. My mm -hmm. my floor gets pretty loud, so just ma having to get all your stuff and move to a quiet place is, can get tough sometimes. Um, I don't know about that. What expectations do you have for yourself on and off the court coming in? Because you've got a good uh, feel for how things kind of work, how things operate, what our team goals are. Um, I really, personally, I really want to be playing, want to get a starting job, mm -hmm. um, just for volleyball. But for a school, I really want to stay above a, like a 3.5 if I can, just really buckle down to my studies. Okay. Have you been able to, to uh, have you had a chance to meet anyone else in the athletic department other than specifically the volleyball coaches and had a memorable time with them? Um, actually, yeah. Uh, I think it was last week I did a video for uh, Okay. For the, the video crew, and that was real fun. Yeah? Yeah. You seem pretty smooth in front of the camera. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much for your thank time. Thank you. It's great to meet you.